Hi, this is a short video to um, explain how to troubleshoot a Basler Gigi camera um, as regards encoder and uh, frame triggers. Simply locate NI Max on your on your PC. It normally there's normally a, a link on the desktop to it. If not, go to Program Start and under National Instruments, look for NI Max. Launch the application. Look for devices and interfaces on the top left hand side. Open this down. Network devices. And here you see that we have a camera set up here called Basler RAL 4K 24M. Uh, on your system, it may have a different name. Simply click on this. And here you have now accessed the parameters on the actual camera. You have settings, acquisition attributes, camera attributes, bar color, Ethernet aptitudes. Simply click on the uh, camera ap aptitudes. Okay. Go here. Go to acquisition controls. And this is where the triggers are set up. You can see the acquisition mode is normally in continuous. And here you have the trigger selector. You have three options. In our cameras, we normally set up acquisition start that be off so there's no trigger for acquisition start we have frame start on this is normally the trigger used to find uh, a, a, uh, to start the acquisition for a frame it could be uh, a sheet moving a plank or a part so if you're concerned that that particular trigger is not running you simply choose off okay and try and run the camera and see do you get a video without that particular trigger. If you do, then you've just proven that the actual frame start trigger is having issues. You can also choose the line start trigger. This is normally driven by an encoder. Here you can turn that off also, like this, and go to actually grab an image. If you acquire an image, okay, without the encoder, it, it will look quite strange because it's there there um, on the, if there's no motion you'll just get a uh, a black or bright image depending on what it's actually looking at it won't be synchronized but at least then you'll know that the encoder is the issue so again line start off okay is a way to test that if if you have an encoder problem choose frame start and turn that off to check to see whether you have a part in place or a sheet trigger uh, um, issue um, again remember to, to take uh, take notes and to actually re return the camera to its original state or the system will not operate uh, properly okay um, you can normally what we also do if you right click on this guy uh, up here Oh, hang on a sec. Right. Um, we normally save the actual uh, default parameters as a file. You can load them up here by selecting the uh, default parameter. It should be saved on your system. Okay, thank you very much.